That's right, Sam. I'm Priscilla Lara, your neighborhood reporter in Lamont. After three years of working together, three local organizations, community members, and the county have released the new layout for the Lamont Park, a project worth over $6 million. A dream come true for this community because, you know, disadvantaged communities don't generally uh, get this kind of funding. Diana Mireles, president of the Lamont Progress Committee, says the application process for this project began three years ago and was finally approved last December. El condado contacto con nosotros. The county reached out to the Progress Committee of Lamont, the Boys and Girls Club of Lamont, and the Center on Race, Poverty, and the Environment, so that together with the community, mainly the youth, could identify what we wanted for this park. Team coordinator for the Lamont Boys and Girls Club says the conditions of this park have deteriorated over the years. It became very, very different. It became very uh, by itself. There's no one here. Um, rarely do you see kids playing or anyone spending time there with their families. Mireles claims that this park became abandoned and that kids in the community often have to travel to parks in other cities to play their favorite sports. This plan is what we need. Kids don't need to go to other places in order to be able to play soccer or to be able to get wet when it's hot. We needed to have a place here where they could enjoy all those amenities. An indoor soccer field is not the only improvement. The new layout includes a water park, a skate park, an amphitheater, an exercise area, and much more. It's very exciting, and I know, you know, uh, after this uh, park is imp uh, improved, I know the community is going to be uh, proud of their park. The Lamont Park will be closed during renovations beginning in February and is expected to be ready by 2025. At Lamont Park, I'm your neighborhood reporter, Priscilla Lara.